Welcome to Ice Fishing Country, home of the famous Otto Step Jig. My name is Rudy. I love ice fishing and the outdoors. I would like to share that with you through a series of videos. In this video, we'll be taking a look at ice fishing electronics, underwater cameras, part two. A more detailed look at some of the challenges of ice fishing underwater camera operation. I was pleasantly surprised at the image quality of my two underwater cameras, and I wanted to explore video opportunities in the number of new ice fishing locations. This was my second year at taking underwater videos, and I soon learned that the best time to capture fish action was under early ice. Sunlight for quality videoing diminishes with ice thickness and snow cover. At this foothills reservoir, the water was clear at 35 feet, but no mountain whitefish. The abyss to the left was a 50 foot drop off. Underwater camera lighting is sometimes necessary, but creates a problem with backscatter. Backscatter is the illumination of particles in the water by the camera light. This lake had an, an unusually dark bottom, so I tried the LED light. By adjusting the light intensity, visibility was improved, but lakes and ponds have an under ice current. Aerated trout ponds have a high degree of suspended material in the water. I was somewhat disappointed at the lack of water clarity in this large lake. Some fish take their time examining the jigging minnow and appear to be almost playing with it. This was a new lake trout lake for me and I decided to set up in line with the other ice anglers, even though I thought this was too deep at 85 feet. The jig was not visible without the LED light. The intensity had to be turned down to minimize backscatter. This is where an adjustable IR lighting may be used. It's always fun to see a schools of perch. Uh, the depth here was 25 feet. Each ice fishing outing is an enjoyable adventure. Each water body presents a different view and sometimes a unique challenge to underwater videoing. The top brand name underwater cameras have some desirable features that I may explore. Some of these include 1080p high definition detail and adjustable lighting. I welcome your questions and comments.